Welcome to Sweet Treasures by Cindy. Just looking at specimens here at Lake Ontario. Looks like a nice day for a helicopter ride. Lots of beach glass and fossils and rocks. Look at the size of this place. It was pretty heavy. I've <laughs> got some things on my fingers. Really pretty details in that. This fossil was pretty um, amazing to me to see the cross section of a horn coral and then the side of it. It was also on a short and some beach glass was found today and some fossils and minerals. I'm glad to have you here with us. Some big finds, some little finds. It was just nice to see a cobalt blue. Um, could be from a number of things, from modern uh, pot, modern glass or some vintage containers as well, but that one definitely made it home. Uh, a lot of people ask, what do I do with all my finds? I don't take them all home. I've been doing this for years and it's just, you know, there's a lot of things that you have to consider of keep preserving the beach and what are you going to do with storing them? This chart was gorgeous. Take a look at those lines. Some items I use for crafting as well. Just nothing more than a hobbyist type crafting. And if you're interested, I can definitely show you some of the things that we uh, do here. And this pudding stone was really neat. I'm hoping to collect uh, quite a few pudding stones. What do, you, what do you do with your collection? My hope is to put it in a glass jar or use resin to um, brighten them up or give it that shine. Although quartz is common, it's really nice to see the different specimens that we can find and the different colors. Pretty rocks there, let's take a look here. Sometimes just sitting down and picking a spot like this and finding this piece of Chelsea and um, pudding stone. It's just a nice little find when you can just stop and enjoy the moment. Nature, the sound of the waves, the sky, and just kind of find sweet treasures. I know that little guy of piece of glass and this one will be used in upcoming crafts again let me know if you'd like to see those but uh, yeah I wish everyone a good summer healthy and happy and uh, hope that you can find what brings you joy as well I know you being here uh, really makes me happy and brings me joy in sharing these finds like another pudding stone <laughs> It's a pudding stone pebble, but uh, it's still a really pretty one. This is just, I want to say, um, quartz and basalt. I'm not sure if it's uh, both. Uh, well, maybe it's granite, not quartz. But uh, yeah, I'm not sure if both sides are granite. Very unique patterning for sure. I don't know why these little ones always bring me joy. <laughs> I know there's a lot of people out there that uh, find some bigger specimens, but uh, I do enjoy the small ones too. Nice big crater at the Godrich Salt Mines here. It is super long. Take a look at this. Have a wonderful rest of the weekend and we'll see you again soon.